Hi friends, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. In this video, I'm going to talk about what is JUnit. An uh, important, a basic Java entry question. What is a JUnit? Say in your uh, business application, you have written a class A, and you have say around 10 methods. Uh, here I've given only two methods for demo purpose. So say for example method O and method T. Okay, and there are some logics. What is the role of JUnit here? I want to explicitly test these 10 lines of code. For example, method O contains 10 lines of code. I want to test only those 10 lines of code. At unit level, I want to test. So for that purpose, for that purpose, I need JUnit. For example, this method uh, it calculates some logic and it returns an integer value. Okay, so for example, uh, based on some condition, it will return me 10 or 100, whatever it is. So what I will do is in my J unit, I'll call this method and I'll prepare the environment. When I say prepare the environment, whatever is needed to execute this method before or stub or whatever it is. And once the environment is ready, I'll call this method and I expect some results. Say 100 I'm expecting. And in the JUnit method, I'll be checking the result with 100. Okay. So a simple example would be two numbers I want to add. Say I'm giving 55 and 45. This method does an addition and returns me 100. So I'll just check here. I'll I'll input 55 and 45. Then I'll expect 100. A simple example. So the point here is I want to test this method at the unit level, not at the integration level, just the unit level. Whenever I pass two values, it should give me the addition of two numbers. So that's where the doubt or we can use mock 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 framework. There are a lot of mock